Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this math Olympiad algebra problem, we have to find the variable a and b. So we are going to the solution. So in this equation we have a power a, a power b minus b power a which is equal to 17. And our main aim is to find the variable, uh, value of variable a and b. So in this equation, first of all, we can write this equation into as we know that any number divided by any number which is equal to 1 so we can write if we do 2 divided by 2 which is equal to 1 so in this side we can write a power p 2 divided by 2 which is equal to also 1 minus b a 2 divided by 2 which is equal to 17 so uh, in this equation we know that is a power m n which is equal to a m n also equal to a n m so we can write this uh, this rule to this term so we uh, have a power p divided by 2 power 2 minus in this term also p a divided by 2 power 2 which is equal to 17 so we can let a p power divided by 2 which is equal to x and let p a divided by 2 which is equal to y so we can uh, write x and y to this term for us is easiest to find the value of a uh, variable x and y then we can easily find the variable of value of a and b so we can write uh, in the place of a p a divided by 2 uh, x x square so minus b a divided by 2 which is equal to y so we can write y square which is equal to, equal to 70 so we know that a square minus b square which is equal to x plus y and x minus y which is equal to 70 so 17 we can write x plus y x minus y which is equal to 17 multiply 1 which is equal to also 17 so we compare these two terms so we have x plus y which is equal to 17 and x minus y which is equal to 1 so in this term we are using in the substitution method or elimination method uh, our matrix inversion matrix commerce grammar rules also used then we can find easily the value of a variable x and y so we are using the substitution method so we can first we can add add we can name this two term to equation one and two equation one and two so we have x plus y which is equal to 17 and x minus y which is equal to one if we add this root term we have 2x which is equal to 18 and we leave x we can divide 2 on both sides so we have x is equal to 9 so we have x value will be 9 so we put the value of x in equation 1 or 2 so put so we have x plus y is equal to 17 and value of x will be 9 9 plus y which is equal to 17 and y will become equal to 17 minus 9 so the value of y will become our value 17 minus 9 so our value of y will become equal to 8 so we have value of y x and y so uh, we recall as we know that we have we are letting x which is equal to a divided by b and b a divided by a which is equal to y so in this place of x we can write uh, a p divided by 2 which is equal to 9 and in this side we have write value of y which is equal to b a divided by 2 which is equal to 8 so if we are securing on both sides if we securing on both sides in these both equations so we have a b divided by 2 square is equal to 9 square and in this side also p a divided by 2 square which is equal to 8 square 
so we have in this term we have uh, these two will be cancelled to two and this two will be cancelled to two and we have a power b which is equal to nine square 81 and inside we have p power a which is equal to 64 so 81 will be we can write a power p which is equal to 3 uh, in the power of 3 which is equal to 3 power 4 which is equal to also 81 so in this side we have write p power a which is equal to 64 which is also 4 power 3 so if we compare this both these two terms we have the value of a uh, and b a which is equal to 3 and b which is equal to 4 so we our final answer will be a will be, uh, become equal to 3 and b will be equal to 4 so if we want to check our answer is correct or not we put the value of a and b in this equation so in this equation we have a power a check so we have a power p minus p power a which is equal to 17 so a which is equal to 3 and b which is equal to 4 minus b which is equal to 4 and a which is equal to 3 which is equal to 17 and 3 power 4 uh, will become equal to 81 minus 4 power 3 will become to 64 will become to 17 so 17 which is equal to 17 so our final answer will become our answer is correct so uh, a will become equal to 3 and b will be equal to 4 which is our final answer and correct answer